Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. Sorry about the hair, just excuse the hair. I've not had a chance to get it caught. I've had such a hectic work at week this week. Uh, hopefully it could possibly even be my last week at work due to this opportunity. Uh, I'm not going to get my hopes too high, you know, it's uh, one of them things. But I've got the opportunity of a lifetime given to me. Uh, so probably when you're watching this video, I probably will be on a plane right now uh, going to I'm not gonna say where because it might give it away it's just insane I can't believe I've been given this opportunity it's honestly life-changing I'm still you know super nervous about it and I can keep feeling just getting shakes almost that like it's actually happening uh, so I am going tonight uh, when you're watching this video I'm recording this the day before uh, so if you haven't seen if you're worrying about where the season 5 videos have been since I did the first video then you know why I've been pre-recording a whole load of videos for this week because I probably won't be able to upload whilst I'm there I'll try and do a vlog uh, but I won't be able, obviously be able to do my usual style of videos while I'm there. It's honestly insane. Make sure you follow me on my Instagram to stay up to date. I probably will post about it on Twitter, but Instagram is going to be mainly where you're going to get to see behind the details, of, behind the scenes of what is happening, where I'm going. It's just going to be insane. But anyway, guys, in today's video, we're going to be covering the AN94. It's such an insane weapon in this game. I do have the Tracer Pack AN94, which is the tier one. It's not. Is it tier 100? It might be the tier 100 weapon, uh, and it's just so much fun to use. Really, really nostalgic. I wouldn't say it's as good as the Black Ops 2 and 94, you know, the original, but trust me, guys, it's insane. But before we do get into the gameplay, make sure you guys are smashing that subscribe button. Make sure you're hitting that like button, all that kind of good stuff early on in the video to make sure you don't forget to do it later on. But yeah, let's jump straight into a gameplay, guys. Let's do this. Okay, guys, we are on the new Season 5 multiplayer map, the uh, Oil Rig. Uh, supposedly it was meant to be similar to wet works off of modern warfare but I am going to have to disagree on that front it doesn't seem anything like it and this guy's right shielding I'm going to die straight off the bat but I'm sure if my videos might seem a little bit all over the place this week uh, it's going to be a pretty insane week for me and I can't thank you guys enough for you know helping me out and being able to get this opportunity that I've been given it's literally such an insane thing it's something I thought would never happen especially at this stage in my you know YouTube journey uh, obviously, the last month or so, my channel's been pretty stale. I've been uh, lacking on the uploads, lacking on the views and all that kind of stuff. And hopefully, this is, what I, well, the opportunity I've been given could change all of that. It could seriously be so, so life-changing. Like, something I never thought would ever, ever happen. Um, I'm not going to discuss too much, but while you're watching this, I'm probably on a plane right now. Uh, probably, more than likely, and I'm not sure what's going to happen when I get to the other side on the airport. Obviously, it's the longest flight I've ever, ever taken. I've never flown uh, too far away. The longest flight I've probably ever had is four hours, and this one is going to be a long flight. And I'm not going to say how much, but it's definitely a long flight. Pretty much across the world for me. Uh, very interesting. I'm just very surprised and very nervous, obviously, with the uh, virus and stuff and things that's been going off about flying. But hopefully the flight won't be too busy anyway, there won't be any two people around or in the airport. Uh, it's one of them things, you know, it's uh, definitely a, a funny situation to be in. But anyway, thank you guys ever so much for that, I can't thank you guys enough. So make sure you follow me on my Instagram to make sure you do stay up to date with what is going off over there. This is uh, uh, just so crazy. But anyway, on to the video, as you get a nice little two piece there. We are using the AN94. So this is my first impression of the game, uh, of the gun, should I say? Uh, and so far, it feels pretty nice. I've not been concentrating too much at the start of this live com due to me just discussing that little thing. Um, but yeah, it seems insane. I'm loving season five so far. The war warzone seems absolutely insane. The warzone gul gulag changes of uh, the weapons are just so much better as I get shotgun to the face. So hopefully, I'll be able to win that even more gulags because when I'm in the season four gulag. Uh, when I'm with the fists or something along them lines, just some absolute stupid weapon as we do manage to get a kill there, my teammate gets a nice little triple kill. Uh, it's just so annoying, you know. And the tier 100 skin this season, I didn't discuss it uh, in my last video because I didn't even realise. It does have like a, fl a flare effect, like when you're running around, obviously you won't be able to see it, but if you saw my character in game, he has like flames coming off of him. It's so, so weird. You know like how I shot, like, shot someone with the... Uh, the bullets, the tracer bullets, and how they have a little flash uh, just afterwards as they die. Uh, that's what it looks like as I'm running around. It's super, super weird, super cool. Uh, I have been using it in Warzone, but might have to actually stop that because it could give me away pretty easily. Just try and run across and try not to be seen. You know, people are going to see me, obviously. I'm like a light bulb. It's pretty insane. But this N94 is so nostalgic. It's so weird firing it. 
I don't know, it just seems it just fire exactly like the old one, I don't think, and you're not gonna run up and knife me. And this map seems decent as well. But the A94 is still obviously a solid weapon. I'm trying to get a uh, Warzone gameplay with it for you guys uh, to watch soon. Uh, whether that'll be soon or not, I don't know. Obviously, the circumstances. I hope, hope I can still manage to upload this week. It's going to be tricky. Uh, but I do have a lot scheduled. So, shouldn't be a problem. It's just notifying you guys when it does go live. Obviously, with the time difference and things. Might be a little bit tricky. So, make sure you do have no notifications turned on so you don't miss out. When the video does actually go live, obviously, you won't have to wait for me to tell you. You'll be able to just know straight away um, when it's going live. It should be 9 p.m. every day this week. Uh, so if you guys want to you know, check that out at 9pm, I would be greatly appreciated. Honestly, I couldn't thank you guys enough for that. If you do that, honestly, it would be insane. Struggling to find someone right now. I've been running around this map for so long. I've not even been able to find... I think this map is a little bit big. I don't know, unless it's because everybody else, obviously this is the first day of Season 5, doesn't know the map. So everyone's just sort of running around, you're going to die. Uh, trying to figure out where everybody is, and you're going to die as well, no? Rank 9 on the A94 right now. Oh, we'll make the full grip. That's what I'd like to see. You're not going to kill me. Oh my god, you might. No, you're not. This A94 is insane. No, oh my days. This guy's going to actually pick me up as well. He's using the new AR from last season. Still a, such a great weapon, that gun. I didn't really cover that as much as I would have liked to. It's such a great gun. But this A94 feels better, I'll be honest. Hopefully we can try and get some streaks together. This game feels like it's dragging on for so long. It feels ten times hotter than it is. Like It feels ten times hotter than it would do abroad. Like in a different country. So it's weird. I don't know. The heat in the UK is just so weird. It's so annoying as well. Frustrating. Because we don't have aircon or anything like that. As other countries do. Obviously it would be nice on days like today. Where it's like 35 degrees where I'm at. Uh, degrees Celsius that is. I don't know what that is in Fahrenheit. Cause I feel like we're the only country who uses Celsius as well. I feel like everybody uses Fahrenheit. Uh, but yeah, so you have to figure that one out for yourself. It's a very, very hot day. But you know, I'm not going to complain. I like the good weather, I like the nice weather. But when you're inside playing video games, it does get mega hot, I'll be honest. So I might have to hop off after this game. Chill out for a bit outside or something, I don't even know. Damn, I'm hoping it's not going to be too hot where I'm going as well. Like, for the week. I can't even believe I'm going to a different country at this time of the year. Like, this, this with not, not even this time of the year, just with what's going off. You know, it's insane. I hope it's not mega hot there as well. I've got a feeling it will be hotter than it is here. But we'll see, you know. Like I said, it's different heats in different countries. Like, it, it feels different. It, as weird as that sounds. But I'm sure you know what I mean if you've if you've experienced it. It's uh, definitely strange. But I should be alright, you know. It's, I, they're definitely going to have aircon there, so... We'll be chilling. We'll be chilling out. Hopefully I can record a video with a couple of them there as well. It's like a YouTube community, if you will. Uh, it's pretty insane. I, I can't believe I've, I've been invited there. I mean, I, I do make myself known in the community as much as I can. But not to the point where everyone's going to know about me, you know? I'm not, like, shoving it in your face 24-7, like, oh, I'm, I'm here, I'm, you know, I'm a YouTuber, I've uploaded a video. I'll just let you guys know, like, oh, yeah, my video's gone live. Check it out if you want. But that's it. So, and I don't know if that's why they've picked me, like, you know, they, they, they might like that, I don't know. Just one of them things, I'm just sort of easy going, just simple videos that I try and do to the best of my ability, the best quality as I can. Uh, obviously I try and get a good, good gameplay uh, majority of the time, unless I'm doing a video like this, which is a first impressions on the A94. This is literally my first game with it on this first map, and this map is dead. Uh, so it's just one of them, you know, it's just sort of a lot of uncuts, a lot of dead parts of the video. That's just how I like to do the first impression videos, but if I'm doing like a best class up, then I make sure I try and get a fast pace, you know, most kills, most streaks as possible. Obviously it doesn't always work like that, but, you know, it's one of them. As I get shot in the back there, and as this game is falling to an end, one more kill on the board. Who's going to get it? I'm just shooting. Please, let's end this game, because I'm bored of this match. This map is boring as hell. There we go. Nice little win there. 27 kills. It felt like I got 3 kills for the simple fact it was so slow paced. Uh, definitely the A94 up close at range. It's just a beast. It's honestly so insane. I mean, look at this guy with the MP5. Wow. But yeah, A94 is insane. Make sure you do smash that subscribe button. I'll be doing the best class up on that for sure. Okay, guys. Unfortunately, this is going to be the end of the video. So make sure you guys are smashing that subscribe button. Make sure you're dropping a like as well. Make sure you do follow me on my Instagram. I'll be posting over there the next over this next week what's going off with my YouTube journey. Like, what is this opportunity I've been given? So if you want to find out what it is, you want to see what's going off, then make sure you follow me over there. Because obviously over there I can post stories and you know all sorts of things. I will post on Twitter still. Uh, 
But yeah, make sure you follow my Instagram mainly. I shall see more over there if you are interested. And I will do a vlog at the end of the week just about what, you know, what I did, what went off. Um, so yeah, it's going to be insane. Without further ado, guys, this is going to be the end of the video. So make sure you are smashing that subscribe button. Make sure you're dropping a like. Make sure you follow me on my Instagram and my Twitter. But thank you guys ever, ever, ever so much for watching. Thank you so much for this opportunity I've been given. It wouldn't be possible without you guys. So thank you so, so much. Thank you so much for watching. I hope to catch you guys in the next one. Peace.